Well, we've now come to my number one of the year. Ooh! <laughs> um, pro- to people who know me from Twitter, that's probably not a huge surprise, <laughs> s- seeing as my name on Twitter is Norma Johnny. Um, <laughs> Yeah, um, from from the moment I first heard this song when the um, national finalists in Finland were first released, I just fell in love straight away. Um, and the sheer joy I felt when, against all the odds, they actually won the national final. Um, you know, I'm still I'm still riding on that hopeful feeling. Um, I will be absolutely devastated if this song doesn't get through um oh. the bookies have the, the bookies have it borderline at the moment um so i'm just hoping that it doesn't get screwed over in the running order uh. um yeah i just think this song is just stunningly beautiful and especially um the beautiful piano instrumental in the middle you know, it it it, it sweeps me away every time I hear it, mm. and you know what more can I say? I, I it's still my number one. Oh, well, it, it's my number two, and it was my number one for the longest time until obviously Belgium came along. But um, yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm totally with you. I mean, <laughs> this song is so me. You know me and my depressing piano ballads. Yes. <laughs> And yeah, it, it obviously screams me. So I, I can't really say much else about um, uh, why I like it so much that you haven't already said. And I know what you mean about its qualification chances. I mean, I'm so scared considering how competitive this semi final is, and I, I, I think I, I'm pretty sure that I can tell this is the kind of song that Beatman would really not like and he'll stick it in the coffin slot just to spite it because yeah. he, he's pretty much in charge of the running orders and uh, just uh, I'll be so mad if it happens. The, the only thing that's kind of comforting me is that it, the Finland song is one of the few... Um, national final selected entries that won both televote and jury. There's an awful lot ah, of yes. Good yeah. Point. There's an awful lot of entries that won thanks to the jury, and it, 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 I think only Finland and oh yeah, Norway as well. Norway's the other one. Um, yeah, and. Um, yeah, maybe you can carry Romania as well, but that was kind of like semi-final was jury only and then the televote was only in the final, but you know what I mean. So, yeah, that, that's, that, that's kind of comforting me, but again, I'm still a bit scared and it'll be Iceland gate all over again if this doesn't qualify. Oh, no. oh, well, I, I really <clears throat> hope not. <laughs> I hope not because uh, I do love this song as well. Um <laughs> It's very in line with a lot of the stuff that I listen to. Um, I think it's quite captivating. And it's kind of got a bit of a Celtic kind of feel to it. Like, I can imagine I can imagine it being sung in a Scottish accent and working. <laughs> it that way. Yes. Um, so I think that that kind of speaks to me. It's kind of that folky kind of storytelling kind of feel that, um, that you get in a lot of, like, Scottish uh, folk music. Um, and I just think... There's not really anything else like it this year. I mean, obviously, there are quite a lot of ballads, but I don't think there's one that's, you know, I, I think you could put this side by side with any other ballad and you could say, you could definitely tell them apart. Mm. Um, so I do really hope it qualifies. It's one of those ones that's kind of hard to tell. I think it would either do really well or it'll just not make it. It's kind of one or the other. I don't, I don't see it kind of scraping by. I see it either qualifying in like second or third place, hmm. um, or, I see, or I see it not qualifying, uh, which I I don't I don't want to see. I think it's the kind of song that should be in the final because I think it's got it's got substance that um, that you don't always get, and I think that um, yeah, I, I I just really want to I want to see it in the in the final. I do. Oh, I 
hope so too. Mm. Yeah, we just need we just need to get it past the semi final. I think if it does, then it's a potential top ten. Mm. But you know, it's just that first hurdle that we need to get it past. Oh, I know. <sighs> okay, so anything else before we give Finland a score? Um, anyone that's listening to this, please vote for Finland. Yes, um, please. Yes. <laughs> Uh, I don't think that yeah yeah because um, me and John will be in Ukraine and we and Ukraine's voting in the semi too so we can't vote in this one. No. But we can get we can get our friends back home to vote because I think UK are voting in semi one. Yes, yeah, so they can vote vote by proxy. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> <sighs> I always get my mum to vote for my favourite if if she can. Oh. Okay, so um, let's give Finland a score. I'm going to give this a five. Yeah, it's obviously a five from me. I think I have to give it a five too. Oh, Ooh. and the public give it a four out of five. Nearly a perfect score. Just one away. Oh, oh God damn it. Oh, well, <laughs> can't have everything, can we? <laughs> 